I started boxing when I was about seven years old. So my cousin was down at Solly Hall, it was Hob Hobbs Motor at the time. So he took me down there when he was like, when I was seven. He stayed there for like a month and then I carried on. I've been there like for about, I was there for about three years, then moved gyms. I've been boxing for about nine years, that's, yeah, nine, ten years in total. I'm Kieran Quinlan, um, I'm a personal trainer here. Been here for two years now, so basically, teach people basic boxing technique, getting ready for white collar shows, um, weight training, anything really. So getting them, getting them ready for the beach for the summer or just general fitness and stuff like that. Oh, I've done loads of different sports and stuff, like swimming, running, all that kind of stuff. But the only thing I stuck with was boxing. It was the, um, it's more the competitive stuff and like just being fit and being in shape and stuff that I really enjoyed. But it's good just getting in the, in the ring and actually like having to think about stuff as well as staying in shape. You know what I mean? Fighting Fit City Gym is basically, it's not like your average gym because if you go to like a, a, an ABA gym, it's uh, there's a few egos flying around and stuff like that because everyone's really serious. But down here, it's like people are all in the same boat. They've never boxed before, but they're all a bit older. You know what I mean? So you have to kind of take them from scratch again. But everyone listens to a really good atmosphere. Everyone's in the same boat, so everyone gets along. You know what I mean, yeah, it's really good, really good vibe. Neil's like, he's, he's not like your normal boss. He's, um, he's basically like, like a brother kind of thing. You can kind of tell him whatever you want to do. Like, you know I mean, he has a laugh with you. Obviously, he's got his serious times, like when, he's, when he wants you to do something, you listen kind of thing. But other, other than that, you just have a crack with him, and it's, uh, yeah, it's a good, good place to work.